Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Christina and I'm an anesthesiologist and a content creator for 13 years and counting. And today I'm gonna to be doing not your typical what's in my bag video. A few of you guys were asking about my work bag, updated, what's in it, what's going on. And I figured since I am imminently returning to work from maternity leave after just having my second child in January, I thought it was as good a time as any because I did update the bag. I did clean it out finally. And now that as an anesthesiologist during a global pandemic, some things have changed in terms of what a required PPE is with the um, advent of the vaccine and uh, more people being vaccinated and numbers declining. There are certain requirements that I no longer have to, or precautions that I no longer have to take unless I want to, of course. So um, I'm, I'm sort of been going through the bag and kind of trimming it out. And like, as I remember, oh yeah, I definitely want to take that to work. I'll throw it in my bag. And I figured now is as good a time as any to show you what's in the bag and what it is, first of all. So let's get started. As we jump into this video, make sure you hit the like button if you enjoy these types of videos or if you enjoy my channel and make sure if you are not already subscribed, you hit that big red button. I make new videos every week and I would love for you to come back for more videos and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos. Mish, mish any of my future videos, whatever. If you see this on my shirt, it's a microphone that I have to wear because there's a shit ton of construction going on across the street from me and I don't want you guys to have to hear all the banging and all of the like heavy duty construction equipment going on. So figured maybe a visual distraction, but at least the audio would be good. So hope you don't mind. This is my new work bag that I'll be using and I will link everything relevant in the description box in case this is something you're interested in or you're going to work or whatever. Uh, a few things about my particular work circumstances. As I mentioned, I'm an anesthesiologist. I have PPE that I wanna take with me. I am a, a breastfeeding mother. I'm a lactating mother, so I do need to pump at work and I'm gonna be showing you some of those things. Of course, you can skip past the pumping stuff if that doesn't interest you, but I thought I would put this in here in case there are some women returning to work from having a baby and are gonna be pumping and are looking for some good solutions for uh, their work pumping routine. I did a video like this a while back and I still get messages from people saying that, the, you know, how thanking me or saying how helpful that video was for them. And that's the whole point of why I make these videos. So I love hearing that feedback, but I also just wanna make more of that kind of helpful content for you if that applies to you. If it doesn't, of course, feel free to skip past it, but let's go ahead and get into it. So this bag, I forget what it's called, but it is, absolutely amazing. First of all, the color is delicious. It's like this pastel lilac-y pink. It's more pink than lilac, but it's got this kind of gray pink tone to it. And it's, it's, I don't know what you would call this. It's not windbreaker material and it's not, if you hear the, it's that material. I think if you hear it, you know what, what kind of material it is. And this is very heavy duty, um, like seat belt material and it's such a pretty pink. Again, pockets everywhere, Velcro everywhere. I am, I am just super impressed. All right, so this is the bag. I'll link it down below. Again, I don't remember the brand because it's not, there's really not a lot of, oh, let's see, Bag Smart. Yeah, so there's finally a little logo right there I was able to find. Um, tons of pockets, tons of zippers, tons of organization. Just any working parent or just working person in general, they don't only have pink, by the way. If you need like a more professional color, they've got you. It also has this long hand carrying um, strap, like shoulder strap, and then these two handles, which you can snap together with this strap keeper. And it has a plastic zipper, which I really like because they're really du durable and um, they, they're not sharp and they don't hurt you or scratch you. So they're really nice. And then these tabs can unsnap here to really expand your storage space if you need to fit something really large, like a huge laptop. I will just take my phone out of here and we'll start getting into it. I have a mask. This is the Air Queen mask. You guys know I love that style of mask. It's my favorite. I will link some really great alternatives down below. And then let's just show you a shot of what the interior. Now, <laughs> I don't have a bag organizer in here. I just feel like that would add to the weight and I don't need to do that. But 
there is everything I could possibly need and more. There's like extra supplies. Let's just breeze through the pumping stuff real quick so they, if you're not interested, you can just go through and pass through this stuff. But this is what I used last time and I'm just gonna be planning on using the same thing because it did, it did me well. It's not what I'm using currently to pump, but I like to just have a really small pump in my work bag and then not have to like take it out and use it at home or vice versa. So if you have the luxury of being able to have two pumps, highly recommend this Spectra Freestyle. I think it's really great as a work pump. It's not hospital grade, but it's enough to do the job while you're at work. Um, the other option I considered was taking my LV pumps, but I did not feel like they were really hospital grade enough or strong enough to, um, they don't just, they just don't get an, I don't get a whole lot of volume out of them. I just noticed, it's just something I've noticed. And when I switched to a hospital grade, like my Spectra, when my Spectra came in, I switched to that and that it was like, whoa, <laughs> I was getting so much more volume out. And I was like, dang, I've been using the LV from the beginning and it was a game changer. So that's that. And then just to finish up quite quickly, the pumping supplies, I've got some more extra flanges in case like one falls and I don't have time to clean it or something. I've got the power adapter in case I need to charge it. I have got, that's it for the pumping stuff and this thing right here. Now I will put a picture on the screen here of what I use to store my um, expressed breast milk in the fridge of wherever I'm working. Um, and then I also put my pump parts, like the flanges, the dirty parts, if you will, um, in this type of bag. And these are amazing. If you're a pumping mother, do not pass go. You need to get this. It's amazing. There's a Sharpie in here. <laughs> but it's basically a waterproof, like a lined compartment that you can put your breast pump parts in. And if you put them in the fridge, you can use them all day without having to wash them until you get home. Because if you keep them in the fridge, it's bacteriostatic, the same as putting breast milk in the fridge. So if breast milk doesn't spoil, the the milk on your pumps aren't going to grow bacteria. So um, that was a life-changing <laughs> hack I learned about midway through my pumping journey last time. And I was like, God, yeah, I was so, my hands were turning raw from washing the pump parts and laying them out to dry every single time I pumped. I was like, why did nobody tell me this earlier? It also has a nice little staging mat in case you need it. You can snap it off and put everything out, line it there kind of hygienically. Um, and then I, I will link everything that I'm mentioning down below in case you're interested. All right, next thing I have to share with you is my new favorite, favorite product for work. Oh my God, if you are in the healthcare professions or any of them, dentistry, veterinarian, RT, whatever, emergency medicine, paramedic, you know more now more than ever how important eye protection is. And I'm partnering with Stoggles on today's video. I've actually been longtime allies of their many companies. So the founder of Stoggles also happens to be the founder of Rove Sunglasses, which you guys know I talked about in one of my videos that went viral. And um, <laughs> you guys bought a lot of those sunglasses. So we're partnering together today because at the start of the pandemic, they recognized a need in the in the market for attractive, like stylish, comfortable, protective eyewear. I mean, when I say that they came to market so fast, it, it just was such an incredible product. I'm very impressed knowing what it takes to start up a new company and start a brand and start a pro I just know, I'm just very impressed. This product has been an absolute hit. I see my fellow physicians, um, colleagues talking about stoggles all the time, and I'm gonna share a couple of them with you today. By the way, they're super inexpensive, and you can get 10% off of my discount code, Christina. I'll link everything in the description box, but if you go to stoggles and you put the code Christina in, you'll get 10% off. Why spend the money if you don't have to, right? So just put my coupon code in there if you want. If you're wearing them and you want, you can like tuck this into a white coat pocket or like one of your jackets or something. So these are the colors that I picked and I'm loving them. Now they're really cool because they come in square versions and circular versions. So whatever size fits you the best and they're making kids versions now, which is amazing. But like, you know, if I was walking around, I wouldn't feel I wouldn't feel weird wearing this to work because, you know, I mean, they're like glasses, but then they have this extra protection here and they're super stylish. Clear is cool. You know, if you like that, if you like that look, 
but I'll show you my favorite favorites. This is a hard choice, but I really like this blue. You tell me what your favorite is on me. Look at this blue. Like, hi, I'm Dr. Brawley. I'm your anesthesiologist. I'll be taking care of you today. Um, you know, it doesn't look weird, like wearing safety goggles would look like, or like the big face shield and all that kind of stuff. Like, it's just, as an anesthesiologist who has to wear eye protection at work, this is, I am so, honestly, I'm excited about going to work, partially because I wanna like, show these off to everybody at work because they're all gonna be like, oh my God, where'd you get those? So what's your favorite color? The lilac color? I don't know, it's between that and the blue. I'm really liking both of them. I chose for my face shape, I chose the square version, but the, you can definitely get the round. Looks a little bit more glasses-like. Or wait, what do we think? Do we like? Do we like? Yeah, I am like, I am definitely a fan. This is, I'm so excited to wear these. <laughs> so thank you so much to Stoggles for partnering with me on today's video. Make sure you check out the link in the description box to get 10% off your first pair or any pair or any order. You wanna order some more, come back, put the same coupon code in, get 10% off. Highly recommend that you do that because they're already inexpensive, which is amazing. So well made. And I love, I saved the packaging to show you because I just love that everything is super sustainable. And if you want to know like lens care, cleaning tips, how to adjust the fit, you can scan that, that QR code. They have an Instagram that I will link down below, but these are, look, anti-fog, blue light blocking. They even have, do they talk about it on this one? They even have, what's it called, transitions, like where you go, like the, the light adjusting ones, where it's like, if you go outside, they turn into sunglasses. It's so cool, I just love that. They're so cool, and what a neat way to pivot you know, in a global pandemic when nobody's really going outside and wearing sunglasses, they know how to make glasses really well. And I love that they did this and are helping protect so many healthcare workers out there. So that was a huge thing during the pandemic and kudos to them for just kicking butt. All right, so I actually have a, I might need to throw this away. This is an N95 that I don't know if I had worn or not. So that needs to go. See, I'm, I'm so glad I'm doing this with you because I definitely need to go through. Okay, so Dramamine. I had this, I was taking this, the all day less drowsy one because sometimes I need meclizine because I get vertigo and it was especially bad during allergy season last year. So I think I had this in here from allergy season, but yeah, because I think it was before I was pregnant. Why not keep it in here? It's always good to have if you, you don't want to go to work and like get hit with a bad vertigo. It's not fun. It's always allergy triggered for me. I've had this for ages and they became a very, very hot ticket item during the pandemic, but fortunately I'd already had mine for a long time. This is a pulse oximeter, which might actually need batteries replacing. Nope, it's still good. So pulse oximeter, I have this in case I need to transport a patient and maybe the pulse oximeter is not working very real well or something, I don't know. Then I have that to help take care of patients. So if I could be like, hey, hang on, let me grab this from my bag real quick. And then there's a mini stimulator. I had no idea that these were made in Stafford, Texas. How cool. So this is a mini stim. And what this does is basically it sends two electrical, an electrical signal here. And there's a special type of pattern, twitch pattern that we look for that helps sig signify the, the fraction of, um, receptors blocked by a neuromuscular blocking agent that we use to help relax you during the case or to help intubate. So this, as they recover, we get a better idea of when your muscle recovery is coming back. Anyway, long story short, that's what that is. Here's my Envivo mask. This is a reusable interchangeable filter N95. Some hand cream by Diptyque. A RX bar, which I need to check the expiration date on. Best Buy, May 30th, 2021. So this expired a few days ago. <laughs> oh, goodness. My sparkly rose gold stethoscope. Well, that's okay. I'll be your doctor today with my stoggles and my sparkly stethoscope. Get out of town, Christina. All right, I have, of course, my ID, which I'm not gonna show you. This is my ID so I can get in and out of the building and show people who I am. These are some spare stuff for the stethoscope, a cloth mask from during the pandemic. This is a Lara bar that's probably also expired. Huh, February, that's gotta go. This is a little, this is a pill box. I think it's a pill box. I think I keep headache medicine in here. Yeah, I keep a scopolamine patch. I keep some alcohol swabs 
and I keep just some Allegra, Tylenol, and some Advil in here just in case I need it. Wish I could tell you where I got this from, but if I can find it, I will link it, but I can't remember, but it's a really cute little pill case. In another pocket, I have, it's like a slip pocket. I'm not gonna lift it up to show you because everything's gonna come pouring out, but you can see in here, I've got all my pens. We use a lot of pens, we use a lot of ink. Another hand cream, clearly I apparently need two. Now in another pocket, I've got a brush. And then this is one of my favorite things to have. Like nobody knows about this, nobody talks about this, I feel like, but did you know Secret makes a little deodorant ball? So if you ever forget or you're like extra running around and kind of extra stinky, they make these little deodorant balls. I love that. I've used that on more than one occasion. I think this might be an iPad brick. AirPods that definitely need charging. These are actually like my really old original AirPods. And I don't use these because I use my AirPods Pro. But because I don't like transferring AirPods, I just use these as my work AirPods. I know, but you know, it's if you got two, then put one in your work bag and put and that way you don't have to switch back and forth. One lives in my purse and one lives in my um, work bag. So these are my favorite pens. So they get in their own special pocket. This is the, the Pilot Energel. Is it Pilot? Pentel, sorry. And then the True Red pens. I really like those too. Nice and cheap. I get them on Amazon. So that's for the most part. Oh, let's not forget Kleenex. That is for the most part, the entirety of the inside. I'm gonna go into this pocket now, which is not much. It's just an iPad. So this is the iPad Pro and it is with the Magic Keyboard case. It's super heavy, but it does act like a computer when I need it to. And then I have a little, for some reason, a little microfiber lens cloth, I guess. There's so many pockets. There's like a zippered pocket right here. So you could like, Put your phone in here when you're going. I don't know. There's like There's so many pockets. What do I have in here? Oh, an eyelash. My eyelashes are in a desperate situation right now. It's everything that's in my work bag. I'm really excited. I'm looking forward to going back to work. Yeah, so make sure you head on over to check out Stoggles because I'm just loving them and you get the discount code. Who knows how long that will be active for. So make sure that you go and check them out now while it's available because 10% is not given to any, just anybody. Like they don't, they don't do coupons. They're just doing it with me. So you definitely want to make sure you take advantage of that while it's available. But I just think you'll, it's so inexpensive and you never know when you're going to need something like this. Like maybe you're going to go on a plane or a train or, or a bus and you're still feeling kind of uneasy about the pandemic and everything, or maybe you're in one of those professions where you're in contact with bodily fluids, be it from humans or animals. I think it's just a good idea. If for sure, if you're like a dental hygienist or a dentist or orthodontist, um, if you're a healthcare professional in any capacity, I think you need this in your arsenal. I really do. And they're super cute. Like I could walk to the cafeteria, to the lounge, to between buildings and stuff and not feel like I need to take them off and put them somewhere because I can just wear them. They're stylish enough to just wear. Thank you to them for giving you guys a discount code. I think that's really nice. And yeah, so check out the link in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I really appreciate you coming back to my channel. And if you're new here, I would really appreciate the subscribe. And if you're interested, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.